The Hanover School Board is one of only a handful of school boards across the state that doesn't elect school board members. A group called the Hanover Citizens for an Elected School Board wanted to change that, so they spent the last nine months collecting thousands of signatures to help make that a reality. Change could be coming for how leadership is decided in Hanover County. Come election day in November, community members will now get to decide if they want to vote for their school board representatives or continue to let the Board of Supervisors choose them. The move comes as a group of nearly 100 volunteers work to get over 12,000 petition signatures of county residents. Well, why wouldn't we have an elected school board? Why wouldn't we choose um, who we wanted to, especially when we choose all of um, most of every other position in the county is elected. So. Amy Buchanan was one of those volunteers leading the charge. She is part of the Hanover Citizens for an Elected School Board. It's a group that calls themselves a nonpartisan, diverse coalition of parents, educators, community leaders, and concerned citizens. The group garnered enough support to get the choice on the ballot, which means they had to get at least 10% of the county's registered voters to sign, adding up to 8,600 signatures. I was kind of surprised that we didn't already have elected school board. A supervisor just decides who they want to pick, um, so that seems very just not transparent. Hanover citizens haven't voted on the issue since the 1990s. She says many people were ready to reconsider the issue. I feel like with um, being able to elect somebody to a position, it's it's straight like you can see how many people voted for those people. And it's the choice of the parents that live in that community versus one individual's opinions about who would be the best fit. Jack Dyer with the Hanover County Republican Committee said the organization is against the proposed change. The committee represents the party for Hanover, which he says represents seven percent of the county's voters. He says the Hanover Republican Committee feels letting the Board of Supervisors appoint has worked effectively for years, adding, quote, we feel more comfortable with the school board being taken care of by the elected Board of Supervisors. We voted them in to serve the seven districts of Hanover County, and we look to them to make those appointments. The two groups plan to spend the next three months educating voters about the referendum and ensuring they vote on their side of the issue. Everybody should hopefully turn up and and decide what they if they want to vote yes or no. And all citizens in Hanover will get to have a say on the issue. Election Day is on November 7th with early voting starting on September 22nd. In Hanover, I'm Maggie Marshall, CBS 6 News.